there, my name is Sarah Henderson, and this is my presentation on stakeholder management. So um, let's begin by just talking about what is stakeholder management. Stakeholder management enables project managers not only to manage the project, but also to manage the things that influence the project. And um, it also kind of controls what information the stakeholders are receiving and why is it important. Um, stakeholders are those that have stake or interest in a project. They will be affected in some way um, in the project or how the project is. So they have an interest in flu influencing it. So being able to manage the information that the stakeholders receive or do not receive um, is important to just find the correct balance of involvement to make sure that the project continues on track. Major components of stakeholder management. When we're looking at our project deliverable, there are two major components. One is the stakeholder matrix, which is a management tool used to analyze a project stakeholder and determine the actions that are necessary to align their goals with the project. And then there's the RACI matrix. Um, this um, outlines who is responsible, accountable, consulted, and informed during each stage of the project. So RACI stands for Responsible, Accountable, Consulted, and Informed. Stakeholder theory um, addresses business ethics, morals, and values um, when managing stakeholder involvement. So that's really where you're going to come in and, and decide what information your stakeholders need to know and what information they do not need to know. It seeks to optimize the relationship the relations with stakeholders, therefore improving efficiencies throughout the project or organization. And then um, we'll go over what exactly stakeholder management looks like in an organization. So how do you perform stake successful stakeholder management? Like we've kind of talked about knowing when and what to report to your stakeholders is going to provide the most um, successful performance. How do you get your stakeholders on your side? Well, just like you would like any other team member, you need to be open, honest, and consistent with that stakeholder. And then the best way to deliver bad news is right away. <laughs> um, you do not want to keep them waiting when there is a snag in the project. Um, and you want to be open, honest, and um, transparent when you give that information. And these are my references. Thank you. Have a great day.